Yeah. Hello YouTube, this is Rusty, and today I'm going to be bringing you a video on probably the most complex skill in the entire game, um, and that is the artillery turret. In this video I'm going to give you five tips to help you improve your usage of it. Uh, if it helps you, drop a like, leave a comment, and download the video. Well, the first tip is pretty simple. It's meant more so for newer players. And that tip is don't mash on the fire button. If you mash, there's a feature on the turret, like so, that will make the reticle lock in place and it won't fire. That's a feature, not a bug. More on that on the next tip. Now that we've established the lock on feature, how do you use it? Well, the lock-on can be used to target enemy doors, manhole covers, and other spawn points and deal massive damage as they come out, giving you the edge in a fight. It can also be used to block off certain pathways if you're fighting a powerful enemy you don't want coming too close. For example, a rusher. Note that after locking onto a location, you'll have to press the fire one more additional time with a slight delay. Like so. is a bit more of a preference, and that would be to avoid using skill haste mods if you're running a hybrid build. That may be a bit more controversial to veteran players, but let me show you why. So I'm going to fire off a few shots, and then I'll pick up my turret, and I want you guys to look at the cooldown. As you can see, the cooldown is very low. Using this cooldown leads us to tip number four. Tip number four, you can use your artillery turret to advance and cover. So I'm gonna shoot this guy right, and then I'm gonna shoot over here. They're scared. And I meant to pick up my turret there, because then I can put it here. But boom, look, they're terrified. And there you go. Next tip. Tip number five, if you're blinded by a flashbang and your turret is not right in front of you as in you just set it up in cover, for example, if it's right there, you can use your reticle to see where you are and what your surroundings are. This is useful if a rusher is coming in and you can't see them because if you're blind and a rusher starts shooting you, you're going to die. So this can save you once or twice. Twice. If the... Uh... The clip cut off a little early in that last one. But that's all I've got for you guys today. Um, I hope this helps you out. If it did, drop a like. Let me know in the comments. Do whatever you feel you want to do. Anyway, I hope you guys. And I uh, hope you guys have a good day. Peace.